truth and sincere. What is up, you guys? Welcome back to the channel. It is your girl Brittany. We are back with another vlog. Now it is Thursday, and we are at home. It's supposed to be the storm. It's a little yeah. The first storm last night. Um, right now, just like a lot of rain. It's coming down. Not even a lot of rain right now. It's just rain. But nonetheless, they're out of school today and tomorrow because of the hurricane. So we're at home, y'all. We are at home. So right now I am doing a little lunch. We had chicken alfredo last night for dinner. So I'm just gonna um, find some fish to go along with it. I don't know how camera looks so pretty. Let's see. Find some fish to go along with it. Just warmed up the alfredo. Um, that's what we're having for lunch. So I got some chicken wings. And some chicken wings and fries for dinner. Just gotta keep it simple, honey. Try to keep it simple. And girl is like already tired. I got so much stuff I need to be doing. It's like, like a, a I just need Capri Sun. I'm like, I told them stop going through the juice stuff all crazy. Because we're being only looking to drink. And I bought two bites of the Capri Suns and they are gone. So I guess I need to make some Kool-Aid right now. I just look at them having a drink. Okay, I'm in here on the couch. Like, what's gets my nerves? <laughs> what's really getting on my nerves with this Kool-Aid? He fills up a cup of Kool-Aid and then leaves this in the pitcher, in the refrigerator. Why did, look babe, this is stuff that will do. Why you, you just finish filling the cup up at that point? Get some of my nerves. <laughs> oh, these kids, how these kids. But they're enjoying their day off. I'm like, okay, I gotta get their room straightened up because their bed and stuff is gonna be coming in this week. Well, between today, tomorrow, Saturday, all the stuff they're gonna be delivered. So I really need to go in their room and get stuff done. Cleaned up before he gets here. So when it's time to build the bed, we can just pull everything else out. Yeah, I just want to check in. I don't know if I'm going to that much today because we're at home doing at home stuff. Trying to clean up, trying to straighten up, trying not to. You know, I know the kids are here, so it's going to be like redundant to clean up. But we're just going to keep cleaning up. I'm sure you're going to keep messing up, but whatever. <laughs> whatever, y'all. Yeah, I just want to check in. I know how this day was going. And this is what's going on right now. And yeah, I'll talk to you guys later on. Hey, babe. Yeah, I should have just seen me just now. I'm sorry. We have fried some chicken for dinner. I got that going. They're not going to do it. I'm like, hey, it's pouring down right now. It's pouring. But the storm is coming. Like, the storm is coming. But it's the mail I don't know why they decided to ship mattresses. I think I just brought you down. Got it, The mattress, these are two of the mattresses. I don't know what the third one is. I don't know why they decided to ship mattresses for UPS, I mean USPS, the regular mail post office people. But they did. Baby sleep, I didn't want to wake him. You know, he's an essential worker. And I need him to be, you know, his rest in or whatever. So I don't want to wake him up, but she can't. But I was like, you got any men to help? I looked at them three little men and got in there. I said, yeah, we help. She was like, you know, the garage, like, yeah, I can't even get the garage out. The garage out the track or something, so the garage won't go in there. I'm like, and I didn't want to go out there and try to lift it up in the rain. So I had, well, pulled the, um, the dolly thing. Y'all know the thing, what's it called? Y'all know the little thing, that the hand um, heel thing that movers move stuff with. I had him drag it in the house. I threw my raincoat, my rain boots. I went out there, she backed up into the driveway. I got the thing. She was able to put both of the mattresses on there. We dragged them in the house. We were dragged to the sidewalk. She helped me, okay, she was like, I was like, I said, I am pregnant, if I ain't gonna be able to like pick these boxes up. So she was able to get them in the house and the boys dragged them in. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I was a baby. 
I hope he'll fry some chicken, y'all. Got some chicken wings. I might do some fries. Got some potato fries right here. Do some fries. That's all we need for them. I had to make something quick. Chicken wings and fries, honey. I'm trying to make a good beat for the in case, you know, we can power go out or something. We can have some chicken for you. I have my computer up now because I'm gonna need to have to have my phone charged. I'm gonna have my phone up too on it. Yeah. Okay. I don't know what you want to do. Like you can eat, but I know you're not gonna wanna go outside. Yeah, your brother can bring your bowl in here. But I know you're not gonna wanna go outside to go use the bathroom. And he's the dog, he gotta go outside. He's gonna use me in my damn house. After he goes to the bathroom, after he eats, he gotta go he gotta go do his business. So I'm like, I don't wanna not feed you tonight. Because I ain't gonna tear my pantry up. It's for food. But I know that you're not gonna go outside in this rain. Didn't I tell you how to quit? He got hands to yourself. Why you here? I told you to stop doing that earlier. Keep your hands to yourself. Y'all need to keep your hands to yourself. Keep both of y'all keep your hands to yourself. I'm talking to both of y'all when I say it. Keep your hands to yourself. How do you keep it? Two kids. There you go. This is going on right now. Um, so like, um, they like, I don't know if we're going to have time to get the beds up together. I'm like, I'm not going to have all your boxes in front of my house like this. He's not going to wait to the week the kids on fall break. Which is October 7th through the 11th. Today is September 20 something. That's a whole over a week. Today is the 20th. What's the I don't even know. Like the 26th. I'm on October 7th. Baby, that's all the way to next week. Like, today is Thursday. You talking about, like, and then probably about the town. They told me when we get back. I don't want everybody walking on my house like this. I want to have that done before October even hit. So, I don't know. I'm trying to get on a call. And this list, I looked it up. You have to on calls. It ain't that much. I might pay for them if I'm putting this bed together. I can do the dresser. The dresser got here, too. We'll be able to be here tomorrow, but I don't know because of the storm. I don't know if we're going to get pushed back to Saturday or not, but. Whew. I'm going to get a I'm going to get fries going, yeah. Nice. I didn't um, put no flour or no chicken fry on the, um, on the chicken. I wanted my wings probably naked. I wanted my wings naked whole wings. I don't want like no crispy, crispy fried chicken today. That wasn't really what I was going for today. I'm a chicken. But they are naked wings. Just fried. It'll be good. I see me things look real good. I'm about to eat fries in my baby. And then we're trying to eat. All right, so I wanted some sweets to eat. So I made us some banana and and jam. I had blueberries too, but I wanted banana. I'm going to eat. I'm not recording. Hmm. Why are yeah, you? Let's go to the table. Go to the table. What is that going to be a muffin? Truth. You get one? Why did you get one? Get a fat muffin. What did you get one? Oh, we smashed it. Oh, it was like 15 pieces of chicken. Is it good? Sit at the table. Don't drop no corner on my floor. I already mopped the floor. Sit down. It tastes like a banana. What is up, you guys? It is now Friday. And I'm here cooking up a little breakfast. Babe is here. The boys are... Still sleep, y'all. It is what time it is? It's 9 42. It's almost 10 o'clock. These kids are still asleep. We were actually made it through the whole night. We kept our power, but now, since this morning, like the TV was working, the cable was working, the internet was working. 
but it got windy. So now it's like windy outside. I'm about to feel. The trees are starting to blow. The rain has um, stopped. And now it's windy. So I don't know if it's going to sell pole lines. I don't know, honey. But now the internet is messed up. The TV, the Wi Fi, the cable, that stuff is messed up. But at least we still got power for now. So that's good. I'm going to get some cooking done. I'm going to eat some breakfast. As they already went and bought some chow. I'm not chow to but some bread. Yesterday, so lunch is going to be. Um, sandwiches in here for today because I knew today was going to be like the day, the work day, I guess you could say. Like the whole, kind of looking, well, I wasn't at the news this morning and they were talking about how bad the roads were flooded and whatnot. So, definitely plan on staying put, staying put today. Um, but yeah. The rain has stopped. It's been raining all, literally all night. Hard, hard raining. So, yeah, I saw on the news with a lot of flooded streets and whatnot. I've been getting weather alerts, flooding alerts all night on my phone. All through the night, all morning. So, I'm just in the house, baby. We are in the house. So, I'm just making up a little light breakfast. Pancakes, sausage, patty, and we're going to do some eggs. And we should be good with that. Put them all so this should go with here. This is soft. Yeah, yeah, I just want to check in with you guys this morning. Hopefully, you all are staying safe. It's Friday. So, I'm just ready to head up a long, like a long extended weekend. So, like, force, forcibly to be in the house. Tomorrow's supposed to be good, though. So, hopefully, we can still do football and everything tomorrow. Hopefully, the fields are good. Let's do a big football. There we go. Like today I'm gonna be ready to get out fast. Okay. Like I said, we have two days now to be here. They need to get out fast. But they say how to leave them off. But today I'm gonna try to really get some cleaning done in their room, get some clothes put up and stuff. Because I do got their dresser. Their dresser came yesterday. One, I only got two mattresses yesterday, and I had, I'm not the call, I'm finna call them. They don't put 50 cents in time now, the um, people from Venus, because on on Amazon it said that both of them, all three of them were shipped out, well, both of them delivered, but then it said not yet shipped, so I just need to make sure and make sure, because they had the tracking number the same on, on two of the mattresses. And I'm like, yeah, and I went through both the tracking numbers in the end, that's on the boxes, and I saw that the third one has the same tracking number, so I just need them to know that. Baby, I ordered three mattresses and y'all only shipped two. So I don't even pay me like that. Let me show y'all. Y'all see how this all say? This is the mattresses right here. Delivered September 26th, which is yesterday. Delivered September 26th. Delivered September 26th. No, ma'am, that is not the case. Was not delivered. One of them was not delivered. I just need them to not play with me. So I'm definitely going to try to get them on the phone. Hopefully, wherever they're located, they at work. Um, <laughs> so they can answer the phone. Don't play with me. Don't need them. They all say delivery. Like when I go to order details. But I did take a screenshot because yesterday when I looked on there, it said not yet shipped. Yeah, we're gonna figure that out. Oh, here's one of my babies waking up. Hey, Trippy. Good morning. Take him one to your daddy. I'm going to be all over him, honey. Huh? 
focusing on one anyway. I just focus on one. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They mama boys. They are. <laughs> it's okay. If you're coming, she's gonna be a baby girl, I'm sure. But I'm trying. You say you hear him talk about me. Yeah, boy, boy. <laughs> You know when daddies be haters. You know daddy. You know you know when daddies be haters a little bit. Listen. Okay. He knows the truth. <laughs> All right, y'all. Let me finish this breakfast up. I'll talk to y'all later. I don't mind my appearance. I literally been in the house since Wednesday since I got home. Okay. I ain't left out. Anyways, I need something to do. Those with a lot of kids, multiple kids, what do y'all do about clothes? Like, okay, right now it's the end of September, finna be October. And I got three boys. Their room right now, I don't know what to do about clothes. Oh my gosh, y'all, it's so many clothes. I'm I'm ready, I'm ready to transition them, switch them out. But y'all give y'all kids clothes away every year and just rebuy clothes every every year, every season. Or do y'all like Especially if they like staggered how mine are, or like truth is a little smaller than sincere. So, like, right now, for instance, sincere can wear a five, but since truth can still wear a four. So, do y'all like do hand me downs? Because, well, he gonna need all new clothes, his legs be growing, he's gonna be seven in a few weeks. So, it's like, so it's like I can give sincere, I mean, I can give y'all can give sincere, wealth old clothes, and Truth can wear sincere old clothes. What's gonna need new clothes? And plus he in uniform. So most of the week most of the time he needs just uniform stuff anyway. He need a few weekend clothes or whatever. I can buy him like about ten outfits for weekends, but pretty much he good. But it's just like I don't know, like with the summer clothes. I'm ready to take them things out of the closet and like start putting fall clothes up. But it's like I need to go shopping. So it's like, oh my god, I really don't even want to go shopping no more because I already got too many clothes in the closet in the right now i got clothes from last year i need to go through that i put up that was the sizes like six five fours i put those up last year so i need to go through those fall clothes that's bagged up and get those out to see what i need to hang up from last year <laughs> just so many clothes i'm so overwhelmed and right now let me show y'all let me just show y'all Really, I'm really just ready for all of them to start wearing uniforms so I can get rid of most of these clothes. Because <laughs> it's like, oh my gosh. But it's like, what's the point of throwing away clothes that's perfectly good clothes? And yeah, I know I usually just my kids alike. So, this is what I want to show y'all. So, I'm doing a room over. Y'all, between room getting done over and me finna have a baby, um, I have so many packages that's been delivered and I'm still getting stuff delivered. I'm still missing a mattress. Let me see, I'm turning y'all around. Oh. Oh my gosh, it's not turning around. Why is it turning around? Okay. Anyways, y'all see all these boxes? Like, this stuff has been delivered within the past two days since I've been home. But some stuff has already been here. Like, some of the baby stuff that's been, um, people been getting from the registry. So, thank y'all in advance for doing that. But, like, I'm doing them a bunk bed situation. Which, I'm trying to clean a room up so I can actually do their new rooms. I need to gut their whole room out. I got a new dresser right here that I got to assemble. I got so much stuff. So, yeah, I guess my question really is just, like, what do I do with all these clothes? Well, yeah, I don't see no clothes right now, but it's, like, I've been getting stuff out of drawers because I need to transition stuff from up the new drawer to the old drawer, like, in the closet. Like, they all got their own section, but the sections are already full right now with summer clothes, but it's, like, is summer over or not? Is it going to they still need shorts? I feel like they do because we in Georgia, but I got, like, totes already. Do y'all just put the stuff up? Like, I need to go through these totes and these bags of clothes here. I pulled this stuff out so I can go through that stuff to see what's, what truth and sincere going to still wear for the fall. I know what's going to fall. I know what's going to need new clothes. But it's like, I don't even know what to do here. Y'all, ain't so much clothes. I don't know what to damn do. The drawers are full of clothes. <laughs> I want to just throw everything away and just start fresh. I just want to throw everything away. And I've been at home for two days. And you would have thought that I would have made some progress on this. Like, once I found out the kids were going to be out of school, 
for Thursday and Friday, I was like, okay, cool. I can use a lot of time to get this room really ready because I know all the stuff was getting del delivered for their room. Y'all, y'all think between me fussing about them, keep, they just do too much. <laughs> between me fussing about them cleaning up all day long, work trying to do some little work from home, actually, like trying to get some work done. Like, baby, I I've been not doing what I need. I have not been as productive as I need to be with them clothes. I don't know what to do. I got like storage bags and I got totes that I can put stuff in, but it's like I can't even really transition the stuff out because the weather don't be nobody want to do for real. Like I really just want to take all that summer stuff out, and then I'm gonna have to spend some money on clothes. Oh my gosh! Pray for me. All right, y'all. I don't know why I look so dark in here, but it was bags and stuff all stacked on this side. And down here, got through all those bags, got all those clothes. I don't know what I see random down here now, these kids. I don't know, but it was bags down here. It was totes over here. Now we just got, this is some summer clothes I put up. This is the, what we gotta figure out now. These are all fall winter clothes that can still be fit. They can still fit, so this is what we have left. And we have bags and clothes. We have our six bags. We got two more bags soon. Sorry. Well, we got four more bags actually. We have four right here. Um, two downstairs. Yeah, two downstairs. And one in my room. Of their clothes. That's on the right. Sorry. Well, we did a good job. Yeah. Okay.